Welcome to Science Easy Tech channel, Nursing Made Easy. In this video, we are going to discuss about limitations and delimitations. Before moving on to the topic, if you are new to Science Easy Tech channel, just take a moment to subscribe our channel and also to press the notification bell icon in order to get connected with our latest updates. Let's move on to the topic. What is limitation and delimitation? Many times we may have confusion between limitation and delimitation. For limitation also we will be writing the same thing and for delimitation also we will be writing the same thing. So this video will make you clear what is limitation and what is delimitation. So I am going to tell only the meaning for limitation and delimitation in this video. In my future videos I am going to explain in detail about limitation and delimitation separately. What is limitation? So limitation are influences that the researcher cannot control. They are the shortcomings, conditions or influences that cannot be controlled by the researcher that place restriction on your methodology and conclusion. That is, any limitation that might influence the results should be mentioned in the research study. So what is limitations? When you will be finding the limitations after conducting the research study or when you are conducting the research study, you will be coming across uh, certain shortcomings or uh, something which may not uh, able to be controlled by the researcher. So these and all comes under your limitations. So limitations are nothing but they are shortcomings faced by the researcher when he or she is conducting the research study. So these limitations will be influencing the results either directly or indirectly. Influencing the results of your research study either directly or indirectly. So these limitations will be mentioned in the summary, conclusion, recommendation, implication, um, limitations chapter. Okay, at the last chapter you will be writing this uh, limitations. Then what is delimitations? Delimitations will be set uh, by the researcher in the first itself in the planning phase itself he will be setting the delimitation okay so this will be mentioned in the first chapter of the research study so delimitations are nothing but they are choices made by the researcher which should be mentioned so they describe the boundaries that the researcher has set for the study for example the study is delimited for four weeks only okay the study is delimited for uh, uh, diabetes mellitus patients uh, um, in the age group of 30 to 40 years uh, uh, or the study is uh, delimited to uh, osteoarthritic male patients so like that you will be setting some delimitations okay so limitations are the shortcomings of the research study what the researcher identifies when he is doing the research so this will be mentioned in the last chapter whereas delimitations are uh, set by the researcher before conducting the research study itself when he is formulating a statement of the problem objectives assumptions hypothesis operational definition that time itself the researcher will be setting the delimitations in order to have a control over the research study so delimitations first starting phase itself the researcher will be setting whereas limitations the shortcomings or the difficulties what the researcher has faced or what the researcher cannot control while doing the study is called as limitations hope now it is clear for you all what is the difference between limitations and delimitations so that you will not have any confusion when you are formulating delimitations and when you are formulating limitations if you like my video, please give me a thumbs up, share and subscribe to Science Easy Tech channel. My previous videos link I have given in description box. If you have not watched it, please go and watch it. Keep supporting to Science Easy Tech channel. Thank you friends.